All right, today I've got a, a couple of lamps that were given to me from my parents' camp. I don't know if they will be considered antique or just really old. So I've been wanting to clean them up a little bit. So, uh, this is what the top part looks like. Not in too bad a shape, but it does need a little bit of cleaning up. It's mostly just dust. And then the bottom part. Solid glass. Well, it's actually pretty heavy. I'll put this out here. And they're definitely old, that's for sure. I mean, even the cord can use a little bit of cleaning up. Something like this, I usually, I will have in a, a power strip that I can turn separate power off when I'm not around, just in case, because they are um, pretty old. So all I'm gonna do is, I got a little bit of water and soap. Uh, what I'm using is something called Nature's Place. It's got a lavender scent. And don't really need much water. I'm just going to set this in here. To the outside. And the inside. Do a quick rinse in the sink. All right, so there's one done right there. Set that aside to dry. I have one more to do. And just same thing, do this on the outside. I'm using the, the plastic bucket. Because uh, I'm just afraid this would get a little bit uh, less likely for me to damage this than in a sink. This is flexible and All right, rinse that. I was going to do some Windex, but decided to do the washing for those instead. Now the base, obviously you don't really want to get wet too much. So I'm not going to do anything with this top part with this towel and the wet cloth. However, I am going to do the lower section. And it's actually already making quite a difference, which I'm happy with. And I might use the Windex after just to see if that helps any, maybe give a little bit more shine, but I really don't think it's going to need it at this point. I do have a cloth ready I can dry this one off with. So I'm just doing this, so if you have something that's been around a while, 
Uh, you don't like something like this. It's pretty basic. You don't need anything any special to clean it up. Now, instead of doing the other one, uh, what I do, if I've got a cord that needs to be cleaned up, I'll take a sponge that's just a little bit damp, and I'll just put a couple drops of dishwashing liquid on it. And all I do on the cord is I just, just to clean it up a little bit to get the dirt and residue that accumulates really just with time and being handled. And you don't really need to be too rough with it at all. Uh, it's never going to be back to the original white that the cord was. But this will definitely clean it up a little bit. Alright, so let's see if I can give an example. There's this section right here. So let's see how this does. So I work that way through. Alright, definitely much better. Sometimes it's really just having some patience. To do this. And of course, you know, while I'm doing this, once you're finished, if you think you have gotten water anywhere at all, uh, give it as much time as you want to let it dry. You do not want to plug anything in wet. All right, this is the spot I picked for uh, the lights. So I'm going to turn this one on. And there we go. So